Born on September 7, 1982, Matt Brown of Alaskan Bush people was 41 years old. Having grown up looking after his younger siblings because they looked up to him, he received training to guide the next generation and did so fairly well. However, after his capture in February 2014, he had to leave the program to receive treatment for his alcoholism, which was a minor setback. Out of the nine family members, Billy and Amy Brown greeted their lively child with a broad smile. He is the eldest with six younger siblings, including two sisters. Rain was born in 2002, and Snowbird was born in 1994. His brothers are the youngest child, Noah Dark Cloud, Joshua Gabriel Starbucks, and Solomon Isaiah Matt Brown of the Alaskan Bush people, is estimated to be worth $100,000 but that amount may rise over time due to his significant cast position in the show. Rumor has it that he may not be as wealthy as his father, like his siblings, despite having survived the harsh weather on Alaska's steep mountains for the majority of their lives. Matt Brown's wealth increased between 2014 and 2019. A cast member of the Discovery Channel series Alaskan Bush People, Matt Brown is known for the Brown family's claims to lead a nomadic lifestyle of hunting, fishing, and bartering in the Alaskan wilderness. Since he has long struggled with alcoholism, Matt's life hasn't always been easy. He first went into therapy in 2016 after realizing that his drinking was negatively affecting his relationships with his family and his health. Matt claims that hanging around with other alcoholics made him more withdrawn and sluggish, and that his near arrest in 2013 for DUI served as a wake-up call. After finishing his initial course of therapy after a year of highs and lows, Matt returned to treatment in 2018, saying he wanted to change his ways and admitted to having a drug addiction problem. He lived at the Betty Ford Center for a month before leaving early for personal reasons after yet another relapse. Matt's family had supported him throughout his recovery up until season eight, when he decided to move to California and pursue his own interests. Matt continued to appear on the show. He also felt that being in the spotlight and bearing the weight of celebrity was bad for his mental health, so he tried to distance himself from it. After months of leaving treatment to live a clean life and stay out of the limelight, Matt went to therapy for the third time in January 2019. Since then, Matt has stayed sober and led a simple life. He informs his supporters on YouTube and Instagram on a regular basis. He also expresses gratitude to his family and fans for their steadfast support during his struggle as suspicions about the show's future have been exploding since its 2014 debut. Brown's eldest son, who is married and has two boys, is one of them. Due to rumors that he was previously married and that the show's authenticity was purposefully undermined by concealing his partner and the couple's wedding when he and his kids took a photo and it went viral online, this happened. After a brief relationship that ended in 2006, Matt's ex-girlfriend and the mother of the children revealed that the children were actually from her previous seven-year marriage, which ended before she met Matt. The two reconciled in 2014, leaving Matt single and without a spouse or children. In 2016, Matt Brown, star of Alaskan Bush People, checked himself into a treatment center for alcoholism. He stated that at the time, he had witnessed his own conduct spiraling as a result of his bad choices and increasing drinking with friends in Juneau, Alaska. After a year of ups and downs, the reality star returned to therapy in September 2018 and expressed his eagerness to get his life back on track. Matt's family had encouraged him to do so. Billy's father said at the time, we would rather lose him from home for a short while than lose him forever. All he wants is for Billy to take whatever steps are necessary to be healthy. Two months later, according to Discovery employees, after completing a six-month program that included both inpatient and outpatient care in January 2019, Matt was receiving therapy at a nearby outpatient clinic. When he reconnected with his family in February, 
Billy informed him that he had made the decision to drop everything and go fix what he hadn't fixed. Bush people want him to know that they took that move in 201. Matt entered a CER for alcoholism treatment, and during the months that followed, his recovery as an AED technician was documented in a picture coin. The reality star returned to his counseling, expressing his desire to take back his life. Thanks for watching my video.